And President Bush approved an emergency declaration for Texas before the hurricane even hits, just in case. Joining us by video phone is Mike Seidel of the Weather Channel. And Mike, you're getting some wind there. How strong is the storm? Well, right now, Hurricane Dean is still a very strong category four on the Stafford Simpson scale. Sustained winds remain at 150 miles an hour. The eye will arrive on the eastern end of Jamaica sometime early tomorrow afternoon. And if it stays on track, it will go right across Jamaica. It's going to take six or seven hours. So this could be devastating. The first direct hit Jamaica's had since Hurricane Gilbert in 1988, although they got slapped pretty good by Ivan just a few years ago. Brings up the question, of course, then, are the people there in Jamaica ready? They have been getting ready today. Uh, the prime minister has, for one thing, has ordered no more campaigning. They've got a big election here in the country on August 27th. People are out stocking up on batteries, uh, tuna fish, water, generators are a big thing. And they've ordered everybody in low-lying areas and in landslide-prone areas to get the higher ground, and they're bringing in buses to get those people to safer areas. They expect most people will, in fact, evacuate? They know what uh, a hurricane like Ivan can do, and this one is much stronger, and much stronger now than when it came through Martinique and Dominica and St. Lucia yesterday with 100-mile-an-hour wind gusts. It was a Category 2 then, and by the time it gets here, it could actually be a weak Category 5, which is the top end of the Saffir-Simpson scale. Mike Seidel, thanks very much for joining us from Jamaica.